How'd the workout go for you today? Uh, I thought it went really well. It was a uh, really high energy. It was competitive, and we learned a lot today. I thought I thought I played pretty well. I thought the other guys played really well. And we played hard, so it was a great workout. For fans who might have not got the chance to see you play in college, how would you describe your game? Uh, I think I'm a pretty high energy player. Uh, I try to be unselfish. Uh, I try to shoot the ball, play, make, and just try to do everything, a little bit of everything on the court. What strengths do you think you can translate to the next level? Uh, I think immediately shooting and de defense I can, I can bring to the next level and playmaking and eventually really um, high, high level playmaking in the pick and roll by maybe a year, two or three. But I think immediately I can bring um, shooting, defense and playmaking. It's been a while since an Ivy League player has been drafted. Is that a pride thing that you carry into this process, wanting to show up well for your conference? Uh, yeah, I definitely, I definitely want to show up well for the conference. I definitely want to be a, a stepping stone. Um, Jeremy Lin did it, um, a couple other guys, I mean, Jerome Allen, a lot of guys did it. So I want to be the next guy to do it and then be a stepping stone for the next guy in the league. And we have a lot of talent in the league, so I'm just trying to carry that. And I know that every time I step on the court, I'm, I'm not just representing myself, but I'm representing my league and everyone else. So. What are some misconceptions that you think people may have about your game? Uh, uh, I don't know. A lot of people think I can't play against like high-level athletes or high-level players because I haven't done it as much. But I think I can. I think I, I always try to play the game the right way. So if I'm not scoring at a high level, I'm trying to do something. I'm assisting, blocking shots, just trying to maybe dive on the floor for a lose ball. I'll do something positive to help my team win. I think I'm always just trying to win, and I'm not really worried about individual stats or everything. I'm just worried about winning. A few years ago, you weren't sure if you were going to go to Division One school. Now, potentially, you're in position to get drafted. How surreal has this whole experience been for you? Uh, I mean, it's been great. It's been crazy. I, I've always had the goal to make it to the NBA. Even if I went Division Three, I was going to try to find some way. I mean, Dun Duncan Robinson made it eventually, like a lot of players before a couple other players have done it, maybe transferred or anything. But I would have just tried to keep pushing. And if I had to start somewhere else to get there, I would have always kept pushing to try to make it to the next level. I mean. A lot of people like Scotty. Scotty Pippen didn't even play Division One. Like um, a lot of other players, like Dennis Rodman. Like so, I, I knew there was there were different paths for everyone, and I was just going to keep working hard until I could find my way into the yeah. league.